Salam everyone. Today in this video I am going to explain the fact that a function is said to be increasing function in an interval if the value of its first derivative at each and every point of the interval is positive and it is said to be a decreasing function when the value of its first derivative at each and every point of that interval is negative. So keep watching and share my video and give a thumbs up if you like it and please subscribe my channel. A function fx is said to be an increasing function in an interval a comma b if for all x belongs to interval a comma b that is at each and every point of the interval a comma b the value of first derivative that is f dash x is positive and it is said to be a decreasing function if in interval a comma b if for all x belongs to a comma b that is at each and every point the value of first derivative that is f dash x is negative for example this is a curve of a function and this dotted line divides the whole curve into two parts one is increasing and other is decreasing so from a to b it is increasing and from b to c this is decreasing so if we uh, draw tangent at any point in increasing part we observe that these tangents in increasing portion make an acute angle with the positive direction of x axis while the tangent at any point in decreasing, decreasing portion make an obtuse angle with the positive direction of x axis Thus, the slope of tangent at any point in the interval, in the interval in which the function is increasing is positive as theta is acute and so tan theta is positive and in decreasing portion the slope of tangent of the tangent at any point is negative as theta is obtuse theta is always obtuse and so tan theta is negative and since we know that 
the slope of a tangent to a curve y is equal to fx is equal to the value of f dash x at that point. Thus, we may conclude that a function fx is increasing if f dash x is positive and decreasing if f dash x is negative.